Hey music fans, as a roadie I had this great opportunity to tour with all these bands. I wrote a book about my experiences on the road and it was the number one new release on Amazon and Bios and it's now sold millions of copies on Kindle. I'm Joel Roadie and this is my podcast, Party Like a Rockstar. So I don't know about how this one's going to go. This is a band called Ginger, and this here is my friend John Mann. John Mann has been touring with Elton John since the late 90s. He's done over 2,300 shows with them. I say I'm not sure about Ginger because I don't know if this is the vein of music that John would usually listen to, which might be fun. I picked it because you guys told me to. You guys, a number of you said this would be a fun reaction with him, so... Let's jump into it and let's see what John has to say about Ginger. So this was recommended to me by a, a subscriber and then a few people gave it a thumbs up. So I figured that means, hey, let's do it, right? And so it's a band called Ginger. Uh, you're on the fence if you've heard of them or not. The track's called Home Back. It was the one that they told me to play for you. This is the official video. Let's give it a go. Fire! 
Just like an Elton John show, right? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. What'd you think of that? It's a little bit out of your uh, uh yeah, yeah, I got I got a little tired of that. I got a little tired of that, you know, the uh rip my throat out sound. Um but I love the little like weird little jazz interlude in there. It was like, okay, it, you know, it just shows that they've got a little bit of um, you know, spontaneity with their creativity in a way, right? Shift. Like yeah, like a little shift, like a like a cool shift. Like, all right, we can we can throw a little jazz in here, which was really a nice break from from the uh, from <laughs> <laughs> from the room. I, I would all, well, obviously, I'm sure they have other songs where they don't sing like that all the time, right? Maybe. Are <laughs> you? <laughs> 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 you, would, you would hope so. Okay, yeah. I got a little tired of that, but I, I the the band was great and the song was cool too. But it was. Good. After a certain point, though, when with that sound, it's like you can't hear the melody, you know, like, uh, and, I, and I want to hear the melody a little bit. So if my criticism to Ginger, and definitely was not the same Ginger I was thinking of. Um, <laughs> okay. You know, they're bands that they're on Napalm Records. That should tell you something. Yeah, yeah. Cool. All right. Well, I really do appreciate your time today. Thank you for it. You know, thank you for it. And uh, of all the bands we listened to, and I, I did have you listen to quite a lot, what would be the band that you would want to listen to one more track of uh, again? What what would be the next, the first in line that you'd want to listen to? Uh, um, the guy from Kazakhstan piqued my interest a little bit. And so did the, uh, the very first band. Nightwish. Nightwish. And, and the Japanese band. Um, uh, uh, Love Bites band made, Nemophila. Uh, I think the very first one, Love Bites, where they, uh, yeah, yeah, not not the you're right, yeah, Love Bites. Love Bites is the white wedding gown. Yeah, yeah, I think I would, I think I would check them out again, and then definitely, okay, cool. and definitely that drummer, uh, the dr the girl drummer, which I can't, of course, think of her name right now. Oh, she was amazing. Yeah, yeah, that was really fun. I got to admit, uh, Senri Kawaguchi. Yeah, I wonder if she's actually plays with a band. That's what I'm gonna have to. I have to do some looking, but I'm intrigued. She was fantastic. So. Kawaguchi, I'm I'm writing that down. Yeah, um, oh, yeah, yeah. She, I'm sure she probably does with chops like that. I hope. Fantastic stuff. All right. Well, I'll talk to you soon, and I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah, we'll do it again, man. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. <laughs> Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the show. I now have a Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Discord, and even a Patreon. The Patreon you can join for as little as one buck. The handle on all of them, it's of course, Joel Rohde. I'll see you guys on the next one.